Here's how to quickly and easily set up your funnel tracking so that you understand your conversion rates, where people are coming from, on what device are they converting, etc. It's quite easy. So inside of site behavior, all you need to do is go over to the charts area after you've set up the initial tracking. And then from here, we're gonna go create a chart. What you wanna do is click on funnel, and then name the funnel. Let's say that I wanna track people who go to my Google Ads Specialist page. And from here, step one might be they land on the Google Ads Specialist page from SEO, for example, or a Google Ad or Facebook. Let's say that next step, I have one button on that landing page and I direct people over to book meeting. The URL needs to match book hyphen meeting. And then let's say the final step, I had some sort of thank you page, general thank you. And that's going to create a funnel that kind of looks like this. And I'll show you how it works. Create chart, open that chart that it's just created. Now, what you can do is you can filter over the 90 days or a year or 30 days, as long as you've collected the data inside of site behavior already, which I have. From here, what you see is the conversion rate. You can see the conversion rate on mobile versus desktop. We can see the source and UTMs. So where people are actually coming from like how many visitors are arriving and how many convert and what the conversion rate is based on those visitors. So what you can see is people land on the Google Ads landing page and then about 43% of those people go to the book meeting page and only 4% of those people go to the thank you page. Now what the heck is the open funnel versus closed funnel? So the open funnel is when visitors enter the funnel at any step and they decide to skip some of the initial steps. So let's say they go from the Google Ads specialist page and then they go to the home page and then a blog article and then they make their way to the book meeting page. That's essentially what an open funnel means. Closed funnel is like, hey, they need to exactly land on this page and go straight to the book meeting page. They can't go anywhere else. And that's where you want to track that initial funnel. How effective is your process of getting people to book and then people not getting distracted and just simply going to the thank you page from there. So you see the numbers are lower, okay? Because it's not open funnel.